So this question provides us with an equation. I always like to rewrite that down whenever it's provided. So 4 pi r squared. The information provided says at a large distance r from a radio antenna, the intensity of the radio signal i is related to the power of the signal p by the formula above. All right, so this is really just a formula relating radius or distance, I'm sorry, intensity and power. So question 22 says, which of the following expresses the square of the distance? So that's r squared. So pretty much using like my translate word problem skills on this where I want to not just read the question all the way through and translate everything that I see. So basically, which of the following expresses the square of the distance or r squared from the radio antenna in terms of the intensity of the radio signal? And the power. So anytime I see in terms of, that means whatever was mentioned before in terms of is on the left side of the equation. And then I have an equal sign and then whatever is mentioned after, right? So intensity and power must be on the right side. So in essence, I'm taking this original equation and I'm solving, right? Solve for r squared. So let's do that. So I have i equals p over 4 pi r squared. I want r squared on the left side, so I'm going to multiply both sides by r squared so that the r squared cancels out on the right-hand side. Now I have r squared i equals p over 4 pi. And then lastly, because I want r squared um, isolated, I'm going to divide by i and the same thing I can do here, I'll, I'll just say multiply by 1 over i. So dividing by i and multiplying by 1 over i is the same thing. So that gets rid of my i's over here, and I'm left with r squared equals p over 4 pi i, right? Because just multiply straight across here, leaving you with that. And therefore, the correct answer looks like is choice B. So I call these types of questions rearrangement questions, right? So it's all about moving a variable from one place to another.